Hey guys, so I know I haven't made 3x3 walkthrough solves in a really long time, but I am going to be making 5 for all of you today. The cube I will be using is the Yue Xiao, I think that's how you pronounce it. And I actually won't be leaving the scrambles in the description, just because I think it's more important that you pay attention uh, rather than follow along. So let's just get into the first scramble. Okay, so for this cross, I would definitely do yellow, um, because I already have this cross piece in, and this one. And then these two aren't that hard to get in. So what I would do is I would bring this down, but first I would bring this over. So then I can insert that with an extra move. And then I just insert that. So this doesn't seem like a very good way to have F2L set up from the start, but this pair isn't too bad, so I guess I'd do that first. And then I'd probably do these two. And then I'd do these two. And then finally these, which is not going to be set up very well. Rotate and do that. And then OLLCP or COLL, I think that's COLL. And UPERM. Alright, for this scramble I would also do yellow because it's a uh, form of cross. Um, because I have this piece, these two pieces right here, uh, which can be set up with each other. And then these two can be in two moves, and then just one more move to permute everything. So I would insert this, and then do these two, like that, and then a D-prime to finish off the cross. And then the first pair I would do is green and red. So I'd rotate because that sets this up better. And then I can do those in the back and then I have these and these so I probably do these first and then these and then uh, OLL and an APRIM okay so I definitely do white for this because this is a three move cross um I have cross pieces here 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 and here and if you notice, these two are in uh, correct orientation with each other, so I can just do D2 to set those up. And then I can do R2, F2 to get these in. And then I have different pairs to choose from. None of them are particularly good, but I'd probably do these two. And then I do these, which sets this up, so I'd cancel into that. Like that. And then rotate and do these last two. So then I have this OLL, and I just do like that, and PLL. Okay, I would do white for this. It's not that great, but it seems to be better than yellow. So I have cross pieces here, 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 and here, and I can put these two in correct relation to each other in two moves like that. And then I can add this one in by doing D prime, R prime, and then another D prime. And I could do an R prime, but then I saw this pair. So I'm going to move that out of the way first. Insert that. And then I have this in the back. And I can cancel into these two. And then finally these two. OLL. And UPERM. For this I would do white. Because all these pieces seem to be easily able to put on their opposites, so then I can fix it all with a D2 at the end. So I would probably do it something like this. I'd put these two in first, L prime, F prime, and then I do these two with R prime, back prime, R prime, and then down two. So then I would do this pair first, and then I would do these two, which sets this up. And then I'd insert that in the back. And then um, I'd probably do something like that. And then I do OLCP for this case. And a Z perm. Okay, so that's it for these five quick 3x3 walkthrough solves. I hope you were able to get something out of this video. If you did, be sure to leave it a like and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye!